All right, Halos, welcome back. Uh, so we have just finished um, one of the previous levels. I believe it was Pumpkin Pastures, but I just wanted to show you guys I actually did um, one level of enchanting into stunning, which gives us a 5% chance to stun enemies, temporarily stun enemies. And then I also went out and maxed the longbow's power just for now. We can always uh, salvage it later and get those points back, but uh, that took six enchantment levels, actually. Um, and it gives us 33% more uh, raw damage. I believe that is not factored into this, so it's actually more damage than that. Um, so yeah, quite a bit of extra damage there, just for free, basically. And then... Let's go straight into the next mission. I believe I want to actually go ahead and do Soggy Swamp real fast. Um, it's a pretty good one, honestly. Level 16, one and a half difficulty. I think we'll just do the regular one that it's recommended. Uh, so yeah, let's do Saki Swamp real fast, and then we can do Cacti Canyon once we're done with this one. This one's basically like a mini mission. It's not like an official mission. Not a big one. But um, it's an official one of the game, I guess. A coven of wicked witches live at the heart of the sinister swamp. They conjure up all manner of brews to empower the arch illager and his ever-growing army. <laughs> What's that going on in his head? Those witches, the illagers will be unstoppable. But tread carefully. The swamp is home to many horrors. All right, that's us. We got our firebrand in hand. I think that's what it's called, right? I already forgot. Hawkbrand, yeah, that's the one. All right, I think there is a, a, a weapon called Firebrand, though. Let's check out over here real fast. Oh, okay. Don't fall into that stuff, I guess. That will instant down you, it seems. I did not, I don't remember that, to be honest. All right, let's check out these guys down here real fast. Boom. How much damage is that? 51, wow. Quite a bit. That's the uncharged attack as well. Alright, anything over here that I missed? Doesn't look like it. Let's continue on then. I don't remember what light as a feather is. Oh, it's like a little bit of a jump, I guess. over here? No, I did not. Alright, yeah, the witches are quite annoying, to be honest. And that is the main enemy in this one. Do some burn. They'll burn you a little bit and stuff. At this low level, it's not quite as bad, but, um, yeah, they can be, they can be pretty tough. Especially if you play on like a harder difficulty, like a 1.5% or uh, no 1.5 isn't too bad, but like if it's a two two times difficulty multiplier, it can be pretty pretty tough sometimes. Actually, right, let's go around. Check out these guys. Did I miss anything over here? No, I didn't. <laughs> Just using the jump for fun now. Ooh, arrow bundle. Don't mind if I do. Getting wrecked by the mini slimes a little bit there. Critical hit, nice. Good stuff. I think we got everyone on this little area. Let's continue on. Destroy the bruise. Zero of five. A perilous potion. Oh, interesting. I think I shot that potion in the air there. Don't quote me, but I think I did. It's about to die there, not gonna lie. There's a lot of enemies here. Hurting us quite a bit.
got an evocation robe. Oh my gosh, I'm getting wrecked. Oh, good. Got a potion back just in time. Where is that guy? I didn't see him. Alright, destroy the bruise. Let's destroy this one. Bonk. Mushroom there a little bit. We got most of them killed already, but not quite all of them yet. Okay, took a little health drinking potion there. What a legend. Let's get this one. Good, we got an apple. That'll help us heal back up a little bit. All right, I think we, I think we got all five actually. Didn't we? Yeah, we did. Anything I missed over here? That's a little corner. I did not explore that yet, but um, it's fine. All right, let's continue back the way we came. And now this area is a little open. A scatter crossbow. Oh yeah, let's check out the stuff we got. So we actually have evocation robe, which is a uh, less artifact cooldown, more move speed, and 51 health. Um, it's not quite as good as the one we have right now, but um, it's useful. It'll looks like it won't actually increase our power for some reason. That's fine. Scatter crossbow fires uh, three bow arrows. Looks like maybe, but it is better than what we have right now. So we'll go ahead and do that. And Excuse me. Uh, I kind of want to do power on it. You know what? I will do power. Well, no, let's hold off on it for a second. Alright. Um, that does increase our power, though, to level what is it, 13. Okay, we got an Enderman. We got to fight now. Okay, nice. We got him. That's a little bit tough, but we got him. And we leveled up, nice, good stuff. Where did that little pig go? There he is. Give me my stuff, Hunter's Promise. Ooh, what is that? Let's check that out real fast, what is that? Level 17 bow, wow. It's a unique bow, uh, it's a charged bow. Chance to regain arrows, oh nice. So it has infinity, basically. Not quite, but pretty good. Uh, pets attack targeted mobs. Yeah, let's definitely get that. That'll increase our level as well. Now power level 13. Burst bowstring. Shoots mobs when you when you roll. Right. Okay. We don't need that. But yeah, cool. All right. Let's go ahead and check that out. And let's explore the little area here. Got another chest here. don't know if this like actually gives you a jump. I don't think so, but it almost looks like it. <laughs> uh, let's continue on. We already explored that way. That's where we came from. This is the way we need to go. Mushroom should also cool down quicker since we have the artifact damage or artifact cooldown uh, perk from this evocation rope. Yeah, yeah, I'm kind of getting wrecked a little bit. Be okay though, I think. We could play it a little bit safer if we wanted to too. Using our bow and such. Pretty, pretty hard enemy, honestly. But we'll be fine. Got a scatter crossbow. It's worse than what we have right now, though. That's what 
what the down arrow means. At least worst level. It looks like we, it wants us to go right, so I'm gonna go left. Get our whatever bonus stuff is over here. There we go, nothing in the corner. Not much over there except that slime. That's fine though. Arrow bundle, yes please. Nice. Uh, it looks like that's where he wants us to go, so let's go on this little bonus area. quite a bit of damage on this bow, right? Uh, 29 to 69, yeah, that's pretty, pretty nice. Especially if you charge it. Anything down here? A little bit of a emerald urn pot thing, whatever. Looks like that's pretty much it for this area. But we do have this. Looks like a scatter crossbow level 18, wow. That's kind of cool. Uh, it's a little better than what we have, but it's not increasing our, increasing our power by that much. Um, so I think I'm actually going to keep this for now. That's uh, it's only three more damage for the lowest damage, but we do get the chance to regain arrows from this. I'll keep that for now, but um, yeah, we, we might switch it over if we need to. Crits right there in a row. That's what we like to see. Uh, nothing I missed over there. Alright, that hurt a little bit. Let's get this chest real fast. Hunting bow. Looks like it's the same level. Yeah, pets attack and target mobs. It's fine. We'll keep what we got though. Because ours is unique. Quite literally. Alright, nice. Supplies are good because I need that bread that I picked up very quickly. More arrows are nice. Boss on this map is actually relatively hard, especially if you go in like harder difficulties. If I remember correctly, correctly. Oh, nice! Don't mind if I do. I will take an apple. Where did I get there? Oh, we got a glaive. That's way better than level than what we have. Let's let's switch over on that. So our hawk baron was 21 to 34, um, and this glaive is 38 to 55, and it has a longer melee reach as well. Uh, power is more on the glaive, speed is less, it looks like, and the area is more on the glaive, so yeah. Looks like we'll attack a little bit slower, but that's fine. Something over here we a little bit missed. Let's go ahead and grab that real quick. Oh, it's a little bonus area. This is it's definitely the bonus area. Right, let's check this out real fast. Is there a puzzle in here or anything? Looks like a boss battle, maybe?
Alright, that should be all of them. Yep. Nice. Alright, we got a new location. What is that? Soggy Cave unlocked. Okay. Let's activate that. Let's continue on. Okay, looks like we came out of that area. So it's just the other side of it, basically. does have quite long range, which is nice. Oh, whoops, we jumped into the water. My bad. We'll go up this direction. Ah, nice try, bud. Let's get this real fast. Arrow bundle. Let's grab this chest real quick. What's our foul level now? 14, nice. Oh, wait, we missed something down at the bottom here. Is there anything over here? No, just a little area we, I thought we missed, but it looks like we're good. <laughs> the noise. All right, we should be approaching the, uh, the cauldron pretty soon. So let's find the cauldron. Yeah, there it is. Potion back if we can. Gosh. Okay, there we go. hard actually yep and then it, c it only gets harder if you do a higher difficulty Oof, my goodness all right what we got there we got a evocation robe which is one level less than what or one level not as good as what we have this one actually has a better enchantment in my opinion and a little bit better damage actually even though it's the same level so let's do uh let's do multi-shot i like this one <laughs> what's this artifact charge and punch don't need any either of those really I'll go ahead and salvage this for the enchantment levels, though. I don't really want to salvage this yet. Sharpness, Illager's Bane. I do look like sharpness. Straight up increases your weapon's damage. That's pretty good. Alright, last little guy we missed. Oh, wait a second. Standing on something. Oh, here he is. Let's go ahead and unlock this guy. Got a gift wrapper. Nice. That you can gift uh, items to your friends, I believe. That's pretty cool. All right, and that's the end of the level there. Victory. The Witch's potion supply is no more, and it will be a long time before the witches recover from this blow. Well yeah, it done. Will be. All right, traveling back to camp, and then we'll get our artifact bonus. There we go. Open that bad boy up. Fishing rod level 16. Nice. Good. Now we can use the fishing rod again, so we'll go ahead and swap that out for the uh, little soul lantern thing there. This won't give us power 16, will it? No, it won't. I didn't think so. Uh, but yeah, alright. The only thing now we need to upgrade is the fireworks arrow, or get a new one. Either way. This will stun for 3.6 seconds, and it's 1.5 second cooldown. 
This one was only 3.1 seconds. So it's not a whole lot of big upgrade, but it's definitely better. Gift wrapper is over here. Let's you send items send items to other players when playing multiplayer. We're playing single player, so it's basically useless in, in our our world, but it's fine. Um, I believe, if I'm not mistaken, after every uh, every level you do, there's a new chest that spawns. Don't call me crazy, but I think I think that is the case. If I can find where the chest is, that's always the tricky part. Sometimes it spawns up here. Oh, here it is. Yep, perfect. Nice. 50 more emeralds for free. That's what we like to see. Alright, well, that's going to be it for this today's episode. We just finished, um, what was it, Sog Soggy Swamp, and then Soggy Cave is going to be the next uh, secret mission. Actually, we could go ahead and do it now real fast if you guys, if you guys are down. I think I, I'd be down with it. Should we do it? Hmm... Hmm. You know what? Nah, now we're not gonna do it. All right, we'll uh, we'll check it out next time. I believe it is a shorter mission though, so we can definitely get it uh, get it in the next time uh, next part pretty easily, as well as doing a, a full other mission on top of it. But yeah, either way, um, thank you guys for watching. I appreciate it, and we'll catch you in the next one. Peace.